this inspiring video, we're going to dive into the remarkable projects initiated by the Japanese government in Afghanistan in 2023. These projects are set to create a positive impact and contribute to the betterment of Afghan communities. Japan is joining hands with the Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO, to embark on a transformative four-year journey in partnership with the Japanese government. Their mission? To enhance the amount of irrigated land, boost food production, and strengthen food security in Kuna province, located in eastern Afghanistan. With a generous budget of $9.5 million, this project, facilitated by the Japan International Cooperation Agency, brings direct environmental benefits to the local communities. It's not just about boosting food production, but also safeguarding fragile grasslands and vital groundwater resources, especially given the increasing impacts of climate change. Access to water is crucial in Afghanistan, where over 70% of food production relies on irrigation. This project aims to restore the Nurgle Irrigation Canal in Kuna province, enhancing the quantity and reliability of irrigation water. The results are remarkable, increasing the irrigated agricultural land from 70 hectares to a stunning 643 hectares, leading to a remarkable 12% boost in productivity. But the impact goes beyond numbers. It transforms the lives of poor rural households who can now plant two wheat crops a year, improving income, flexibility, and food security. Not only that, but the project also strives to protect more than 2,000 hectares of fragile grasslands through improved and adapted plant species. This project builds upon the Green Earth Project, initiated in 2003 by Tetsu Nakamura and Peace Medical Services Japan, which has already converted 23,800 hectares of dry farmland into flourishing fields, benefiting over 650,000 people. It's a story of hope and resilience, a testament to the hard work and determination of the Afghan people. Japan continues to stand by Afghanistan, fostering self-sufficiency and recovery. But Japan's commitment doesn't stop there. In September 2023, they partnered with UNICEF to construct and renovate 165 primary schools across Afghanistan. A $25 million initiative to provide safe learning environments for 33,000 children, complete with classrooms, toilets, hand-washing facilities, and boundary walls. Every child deserves the right to a safe education, and Japan is making it a reality. Schools become a place of motivation and learning, and parents trust them more when they're safe and enclosed. In collaboration with UNDP, Japan ensures community involvement, quality construction, and earthquake-resistant designs to make these schools a source of pride and resilience. Japan's steadfast support for Afghan children includes improving water supply, sanitation, and hygiene, teacher training programs, and much more. Moving forward, in October 2023, the United Nations Development Program, UNDP, and the Government of Japan unveiled a two-year project to empower women in the private sector across seven Afghan provinces. This $10 million initiative is a commitment to strengthen the economic power of Afghan women, enabling them to access finance, improve business skills, and reach wider markets. Not just that, but it also focuses on building and rehabilitating vital community infrastructure, creating jobs, and benefiting all community members. Empowering women in the labor force and economy is not just an Afghan aspiration, but a global necessity. Japan is making this dream come true, creating a favorable environment for women's economic activities. Japan's support is not just a helping hand, it's a beacon of hope, a symbol of resilience, and a commitment to a brighter future for Afghanistan. Thank you for watching.